What's up? This is Lifetime Longhorn Rod Babers with Texas Sports Connection, and we're taking you behind the burn orange curtain. Let's recap the game last week, all right? Texas, very disappointing loss at home to Texas Tech, 48-45. First win in Austin for the Red Raiders since 1997. A lot of Longhorn fans very upset about this loss. They're looking for a reason to lash out. I saw a lot of reasons to be optimistic. Number one, Chris Warren. Can anybody die? 276 rushing yards, four touchdowns. That's a freshman record on the 40 acres. That's something Ricky Williams. Earl Campbell couldn't do on the 40 acres, all right? So he's a lofty company. Also third best rushing total in all of college football. That is something you can build on going forward. He's going to make his second start versus the Baylor Bears. We'll talk about that in our preview of the Baylor Bears in another segment coming up. But also... Think about those young corners we had. Held up very well versus that Texas Tech Raider passing offense. Those two young corners are true freshmen, but they look really good in man-to-man coverage. Something you got to be able to do in the spread offenses against those spread offenses in the Big 12. So that's two things you got to be happy about. And this is something else that I thought was big. The pride and the heart of this team, I thought, showed up. Last uh, last Thanksgiving. Think about this. They lost eight different guys via injury. Gerard Hurd went down. Malik Jefferson goes down. Hassan Ridgeway goes down. You got a lot of guys go down. Peter Jenkins, a lot of leaders, some of the best players on this team, yet they found a way to keep it competitive. They almost found a way to win that game. It was almost like they ran out of time. And that's something that I've been I've been I've been getting on this team about criticizing Charlie Strong about getting this team to show more heart, more passion, and more pride in that winning tradition of Texas football. I thought we saw it out there at Thanksgiving night. We'll see some more of that versus Baylor. We'll come back and preview that as well. This is Texas Sports Connection.